clap. Hey guys, I'm still in the middle of reviewing this IO Inks AR pistol with a seven and a half inch barrel, chambered in 5.56, and like I said before, it's extraordinarily loud. So it got me thinking about what muzzle device would be really, really great for it, and I have one in my inventory that I thought you guys might want to know a little bit more about. So before I do that, I'm going to fire some rounds downrange without any kind of muzzle device. It's just the raw, raw threaded muzzle, or raw dog as nobody says, and we'll see how it looks. All right, so let's fire it a few rounds downrange. Boop. All righty. Clear, 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 awesome. As you can see, it's pretty freaking loud. So in addition to that, it's blasty and it's blinding. So the guys at Spikes Tactical invented their own muzzle device to combat just how obnoxious it can be to fire a short barreled weapon like this so close to your face. They call it the Barking Spider. And yes, it's a fart reference. The Barking Spider is based primarily on the Krinkov's muzzle device or muzzle booster and uses a blast chamber inside to help redirect and dissipate some of the expanding gases from the round being fired away from the shooter's face, as well as increasing back pressure to make operation of SBRs a little more reliable. So let's see how the Barking Spider performs and then we'll get into how it works. All right, same ammunition, Winchester, thanks Winchester, 55 grain full metal jacket from a seven and a half inch barrel with Spikes Tacticals Barking Spider. All righty, let's see how she does. There's almost no flash signature. That's amazing. And we are empty. But how does this work? Is there little magic elves inside? Probably not. So we'll crack it open and see what's under the hood of Spike's Tacticals potty humor inspired muzzle device. Now the Barking Spider works by not only directing the blast away from the shooter in a linear fashion, but also by allowing the blast to dwell for a short time to dissipate and to cool slightly so that it's less explosive when it leaves the end cap. Spike's Barking Spider consists of four components. The body, the baffle, the blast director, and the end cap. In the simplest sense, the Barking Spider almost acts in the way that the first baffle does on a sound suppressor in that it allows for the hot expanding gases to dwell for a moment. But unlike a sound suppressor, it doesn't dampen the blast's noise or volume, but rather dissipates it away from the shooter. Now the Barking Spider comes with two different end caps, a standard and a flash dissipating one. In testing, both were equally as effective at dissipating the actual blast away from the shooter, though the flash hiding tip was noticeably more effective at eliminating a flash signature. One thing to note, just like a sound suppressor, the Barking Spider gets incredibly hot incredibly quick. So be sure that if you're going to remove it off of a hot firearm after clearing the firearm, to do so with a glove, because it will burn you very quickly. Regardless of how the Barking Spider actually works, there's no denying that it does work. They say that imitation is the purest form of flattery, and if that's the case, the guys at Spikes Tactical must really, really love them some Russians, because this thing is more than a little influenced by the Krinkov style muzzle booster. That said, it is tremendously effective, and I think for shooters out there that don't want to invest the time, money, and effort into an NFA restricted item like a sound suppressor, I think the Barking Spider is the way to go. It does a, a tremendous job of dissipating the noise and the blast away from a shooter's face, which normally with a regular length barrel, 16, 20, whatever, is not a big deal. Hell, even with a 10 inch barrel, it's not terrible. With a seven and a half inch barrel, the blast can be overwhelming and completely disorienting. And as you saw earlier, this is a tremendous job of dissipating all that flash away from the shooter's face, making it a go-to addition to anybody's AR pistol or SBR build. Thanks guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more burst reviews.